All right, after that quick cut slash new episode, uh, we're back, and hopefully we won't have any frame issues. Like I said, I don't know if this is a new episode. I don't know if uh, I just made a cut. So I'm not going to say, what's up, Nerds and Geeks? My name is Owen GWTF, LOL, FTWBRB, and welcome back to another session of Smut Shut Your Mouth. Because it's not a new session! We're ending this session, which is still part of the last one, after uh, No Way Out. Oh, we have another Divas match, so I'll probably be playing this, even though... I'll I think we've already seen both of those Divas, though. I think they wrestled at the pay-per-view, or, um, the Royal Rumble, or Armageddon, so never mind. I'm almost positive it was Jazz versus Ivory, if not, my apologies. The Rock will take on Rikishi, and then I will team up with my tag team partner to take on Kane and some other people I didn't really look at the names of, because I was like, oh, I've been here a little while, so probably should move on. But, uh... Yeah, Rock versus Rikishi. I did it for the Rock. Rikishi's going in the Hall of Fame, by the way. Some people um, feel he doesn't deserve it. Like, what, what has Rikishi done to be in the Hall of Fame? And others, myself included, feel like he more than well deserves it. Hey, it's my tag team partner. Let's talk to him. Hopefully he won't be a jerk. Most likely will, though. <sighs> Hey, DDP. Are you... T oh, this is the same thing about the photo shoot, huh? Sorry, buddy. I ain't gonna be in that photo shoot. I've already said I ain't gonna be, and here comes the pain. I was about to say something, though, and I completely forgot. Oh, yeah, Rikishi in the Hall of Fame. Uh, some people, like I said, don't feel like he deserves it because he really isn't as accomplished as some people, but he's not headlining the show. Who are we taking on? Booker, Hogan, and Hardy. He's not headlining the pay-per-view, right? He's just... Or not pay-per-view. He's not headlining uh, the Hall of Fame. He's just going into the Hall of Fame. And there are people who are a lot less undeserving than Rikishi. Uh, first one that comes to my mind is Coco Beware, who I'm not saying is not deserving to be a Hall of Famer. Just want to put that out there. But a lot of people crap on the fact that Coco Beware is in the Hall of Fame. And I would say that Rikishi is more than deserving compared to someone like Coco Beware who's never held a title in the WWE. Rikishi's been a tag team champion and an intercontinental champion. He may not be super successful, but honestly, I feel like Rikishi um, became a really big character in an era of big characters. I mean, if you look at the Attitude Era, which is where Rikishi's from, there were stars in every division. You knew you knew everybody. There was a lot of stars there. And uh, Rikishi was one of the more popular ones. He, everyone loved the stink face, myself included. I wouldn't want to take a stink face, but I don't think anyone would want to take that move. Point is what I'm trying to make. I do believe Rikishi deserves to go into the Hall of Fame. I 100% believe he deserves it. Maybe it's a little too soon for Rikishi, but I do understand maybe WD wants to do it because they have the Usos, so why not? I swear, I, I've, I've taken on Booker T in three tag team matches. It's like they didn't even care. The Bookers didn't care, nerds and geeks. They're like, well, technically, it does make sense. You would want to, you know, have me and Booker T in a match against each other at all times, but it just doesn't make sense. At least we haven't been in one-on-one -on -one matches, so. But he's lost every match. Poor Booker, he's not gaining any momentum. I'm too good. I'm tagging Jericho since he's my tag team partner. That and I don't trust Kane. This is a jerk. I beat him for the Undisputed Championship. I'm almost positive about that. You know, everybody in this match... You know, because we're I'm still kind of on the topic of the Hall of Fame. Everybody in this match, I, I, I well, actually, Booker T is already in the Hall of Fame, as is Hulk Hogan. I believe everybody here, though, deserves to be in the Hall of Fame as well, uh, with the exception of Booker and Hogan, because, well, they're already in the Hall of Fame. I do think DDP will go in. I think Kane will go in. Actually, I'm, I'm almost positive Kane will go in. Um, I don't know if he'll be a first ballot Hall of Famer. Same thing with DDP. I don't think he'll be a first ballot. I do think Chris Jericho will be a first ballot Hall of Famer, though. And um, I could see the Hardy Boys possibly being a first ballot Hall of Famer. 
but I don't see Jeff Hardy alone being a first ballot Hall of Famer. I don't know if a team really could be first ballot, though, to be completely honest. Oh, excuse me. I mean, a yawn in your ear. Come on, Jericho. Uh, I know I brought up my uh, playthrough of the current day on Total Extreme Wrestling. Uh, another thing I've considered doing is bringing Chris Jericho in. I might bring him in because I recently did a brand split. And mainly because I wasn't sure what to do with some superstars and I felt a brand split would just help me build up more popularity. I'm kind of um, regretting it a little bit now because... I don't have a lot of superstars, like I had a lot of superstars when my brand wasn't split, but none of the brands are split, it's like, oh, I don't have that many superstars, you know? It kind of sucks. But, uh... Hold on. Oh, okay. I was gonna, I was gonna go help Jericho out, but... Never mind. I'm gonna help him out now, though. But yeah, I'm, I'm regretting the brand split a little bit, but it'll take some time. And, um... Yeah, dude. It's rough sometimes. But I'm, I'm thinking about bringing Jericho in just to have some main event talent on the roster. I hate that noise, though. Audio is cutting in and out right now. Jericho probably should make a tag here soon. It's either myself or Kane. Because he's getting dominated. And I just got taken down because I wasn't paying attention to the camera. Or, I mean, not the camera, the screen. Because, um... I was looking over to make sure I didn't drop any frames. Hey, whoa! Come on, ref! Did you not see the punch right to the the gro the groin? That's blatant. Come on, Jericho! Hurry up, do something. Kane's got two specials. I'm about to get two specials. All right, come on, Jericho. Jericho is getting it handed to him right now. Has Hardy even come in the match? Jericho! Make the tag! Jer oh my god. He's getting his butt whooped, nerds and geeks. Oh my god. You know what would have been great? I don't think we've ever seen a feud between Chris Jericho and Hulk Hogan, and I honestly feel like that would be a really fun feud. I do. I think that'd be a great feud. WCW missed out on such a huge opportunity with Chris Jericho. He could have been a star for them. I know, that's a little bit random with me talking about WCW, but he really could have. Jericho could have been a huge star in WCW. I really feel like he could have. I believe the referee was knocked out anyway. Yeah, he is. Ah, Jeff Hardy kicked me. Oh no! Booker T! Ah, no, no, no! At least I'm distracting the ref. I was about to say, no, this is horrible. We might lose. I didn't mean to go up here. I got it. Boom! That'll help Jericho. Ah, oh, no, it won't help Jericho because the ref's distracted. I attacked them. Oh my god, dude. No! Jericho, I'm coming, buddy. You ain't tagging in. No friggin' way. Counter him. Damn it. No, this shouldn't count. The referee won't be able to see it. Well, actually, he will. Oh, I thought it was over. I did. No, 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 no! Oh, he tagged in in time! We were so close. This is a good match, nerds and geeks. These matches are getting a lot more fun. Maybe it's because, you know, I'm not as good as I used to be at the game. Get him out. I mean... But, uh... These matches are getting pretty good. 
makes me a little bit excited about uh it's about to happen here tag me in jericho you've been in way too long get him whooped jeff hardy's to the point where he literally has almost five finishers that's pretty sad that happened even though i kind of like nonchalantly walked over there oh why did i go to hebner and i meanwhile a distraction can get in there can get in there can you jerk oh no i've lost oh <laughs> woe is me woe is me stacy will never love me after this well, at least Booker T gained some momentum. What the hell is McMahon doing? Is he gonna beat me up? Look what Mr. McMahon did to DDP! He's not a fair referee! You think so? He's just a referee of strong initi In initiative, right? Yeah, initiative. Dude, what the hell? McMahon just beat the crap out of me! I'm going to be more than that. I'm going to make all of the decisions for the match. So the pay-per-view is going to be an Iron Man match. Oh my, that's not going to be an easy match. He's calling all the shots for the match. Now DDP is in big trouble. An Iron Man match. An Iron Man match, nerds and geeks.